Montana Mormon Misogyny Part 12. Um, this is an update on one of my Montana stories about the guy that abused and let his child abuse a little boy in our, this branch. He got exactly what he wanted. Currently, he is the sitting branch president of the Chester, Montana branch. Isn't it lovely that when you're an abusive prick in the Mormon church, you get exactly what you fucking want? I can't believe the Great Falls Stake presidency did this. That's why we don't go anymore. Kids are not safe. So let's review. You can be a petty little Lord Farquhar living in a little shitty town. And if you pay your tithing and answer all the questions correctly to get your temple recommend and attend regularly and kind of treat your wife like shit and make everybody in the branch wonder if you're abusing her and your children and kind of have this position in the town where you kind of are a big fish in a teeny little town uh, for your job. When uh, you boot out everybody else by either them being too old, having already served, or abusing the fuck out of an entire family, you too could get to be, have your turn as a Mormon demigod in your own little kingdom.